Hey guys, welcome back to Malika Kenya and today we are doing an update video on Rachel's family and her mother's business. So stay tuned in to the end of this video so that we can see how this family is doing. Yes. Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Malika and it's a very beautiful day of course as usual where I am and guys it's bad hair day but don't worry we'll take care of that later on. So guys I, I'm going to visit Mama Rachel, yeah I know some of you are asking about Mama Rachel so I'm going to do an update and to just see how her business is doing you know, see how her business is doing, see how she's doing and also I have some goodies for her, uh, I love surprising her. And you know I love surpri surprising people in the village, eh? It's on me on our gong. <laughs> so apologies for the background noise. Uh, I think uh, we are closer to a nearby hardware. And uh, so, uh, you know me, like when you are visiting someone, you don't go empty-handed. At least you buy something so that when they see you, they are happy. Oh, a visitor has come. So yeah, we are going to visit her and we are not going empty-handed, courtesy of Malik Squad, of course. And let me show you some of the things that we are taking for her as we see the progress of her business. Also, we are also going to like boost the business a little bit, eh? A little bit just a little bit to see uh first of all we, are, we have to go and see how the business is and so far so good i know it's okay i'm expecting like to see good results but in the meantime let me just show you the little things that you're going to take to her and i'm telling you guys life in kenya is very expensive right now i'll keep on saying things okay not only in kenya life is expensive everywhere and so if you can afford a meal if you can afford anything hey just be grateful first of all let me show you my outfit of the day and then i show you what we are taking <laughs> this is what we are wearing today guys it's an official outfit let me not tell you something about this outfit because my camera person will start laughing <laughs> So this is what we are wearing, okay? And now let me show you what we are taking. So this is what we are taking. This is rice. Buy a Malik spot, a 25 kg of rice. This is a 25 kg of rice. At least she won't have like a hard time. Like, you know, like because... So guys, this is rice, 25 kg. Uh, cooking oil. We have sugar which is now gold here in kenya if you can afford sugar in kenya right now you are rich okay <laughs> kenyans will understand what i'm talking about there's bread uh there's soap very very important for hygiene because like we, we, we bathe using this soap like washing clothes washing utensils so soap is very important salt <laughs> jelly jelly this is jelly tea leaves you know like kenya we produce like the best tea leaves in the world eh? so tea leaves and we have like umba this is a uh, maize flour on this side and on this side this is like wheat flour okay so this is what we are going to take to her as we are visiting because we cannot go empty-handed let me call someone to pack it for me or I don't know if I can do it. and it was now time to go see rachel and her family and here we are and i know they're going to be very very happy i don't know if the kids are out of school but come with me
guys, I was very, very happy to see the kids looking good. Like, oh my God, just look at these kids looking good in their school uniforms, looking clean. And I was very, very happy. We, the kids are wearing school shoes. And this is a good thing. They had just come from school. Uh, it's lunchtime. And so, ah, me, I'm just a happy person. And the kids are happy. And at least the kids... <laughs> I don't even know what to say guys but I was just happy to see the kids and also I was very very happy to see how Mama Rachel's business was doing because the business is doing quite fine. I'll show you the business later on but just look at these kids. Look at how good they are looking. Uh, I never knew life can change that fast but at least now that I know like no situation is permanent and at least I know when you believe in God when you pray like God can make things change real quick thank you so much malik squad you people are amazing and you are the best family ever and so far so good this is the business as you can see it's doing well yeah uh, she's saying it's doing well uh the business at least she sells things but uh i advised her to be buying especially the perishable goods to be buying just enough and then when they finish she can top them up instead of buying a lot of things and then the things they end up like you know going bad so this is her business which she's very very proud of she takes care of the business at least she doesn't have to go far and leave the kids alone she only leaves she only goes like when she's going to buy the stuff and she only leaves for a few minutes and then she's back here like to just sell because this business is just right in front of her house and we also added some eggs we brought uh some eggs for her and when as soon as she finishes those those ones she's going to take others because we paid but we could not bring all of them here uh you know the, the kids with kids can break the eggs eh? so i'm so proud of her and her hard work I just told her, I advised her to just work so hard because uh, with time, I just want her to be like very, very independent and I can see that coming. This made me really, really happy and she's also happy as you can see. She's very, very happy and we just thank God for that and we thank God for everything. We do not take anything for granted. Thank you so much Malik Squad if you've ever come through for Mama Rachel each and everyone who is involved in making Mama Rachel's life change because Mama Rachel was living in a very, very tiny house. Like she didn't know one day she will have her own business. Like she will be her own CEO of her own business. And we thank God for all this. So thank you so much, Malik Squad. And thank you so much for the love. Thank you so much for the support. And now let me just talk to Mama Rachel a little bit. Let Mama Rachel talk to you guys. And you're still going to, we still have a lot to from to do for this family. So you better stay tuned into this channel because there's a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot coming. Okay? So, yeah. uh, so far so good. Unasema unaendelea at least kujikaza. Ni afadhali kuliko banya ilikuwa. At least mboga, unaweza pata hapo kwa kibanda. Yeah. Ama. Sasa tofauti ya saida, venya mako ilikuwa hapo nyuma, lakini unaweza tofauti kidogo. <laughs> hey, saini tofauti. Saini tofauti. Yeah. So guys, I'm trying to ask her how life is right now and how life was back then. And she's telling me life is much, much better right now. And for her business, she's really like putting in effort. The business is doing well and she's trying her best. Mefumika light. <laughs> So she's trying her best at least to make uh, ends meet and she's saying things are much better right now than the way things were. In terms of business, like she says, she's getting something which she can't complain right now because she's also eating from there. So sometimes it's, she says it's good. Uh, she The profit is what she uses for her upkeep and everything, but she says it's not bad, but she's still pushing it. She cannot complain. According to what she's saying, what how it how things were and how things are right now, she cannot complain. Things are much, much better, which is good, guys, because we are trying to improve her life and, you know, like to just make her feel comfortable, to make things better than the way they are. And I'm so happy that she feels like that things are much better than the way they were when they were still living in the small, smaller house. Sasa, mefuraia. Uh, so 
rent ya kisubuhi au watoto wako kwa shule hiyo ni kitu muhimu saa hii sio lakini tunashukuru Mungu kaa kila kitu iko sawa hata mimi nimefurahia kuona bidii at least tunaweka juu biashara ni bidii bila bidii utajikuta umeweka stock nyingi alafu imeisha yote tena auoni pesa imeenda wapi auoni pesa imefanya nini ya ndio maana ukiona chakula kaa hii yenye at least yenye imekimelete unakula kando kidogo alafu sasa ya kibanda unapata chance ya kuuza si ndio eh eh so endelea kujikaza na watoto naona ndio wao wamejikaza recho hebu salimia watu sema hi guys hi guys what is your name naitwa Melvin Melvin nani sema jina yako mbili Melvin na Angela Melvin Asimiu Nasimiu Recho Recho na Angela Recho na Angela Ah na wewe Mama Eh Mebo usinio The kids are a bit shy and is not a way to make a skill zuri na wewe mai So ah wewe ngangana bado kuna surprise nyingine Recho unatoka shule saa ngapi Kirudi sa Sasa saa saba saa hii. Eh. So akirudi saa hii shule anatoka saa ngapi? Saa 10. Saa 10. Aya ukuje ukitoka shule utafuta nimeleta kitu kingine mzuri. Sawa, wasita kuambia ni nini ndio kikuja ikuwe surprise, si ndio? Sawa, <laughs> <laughs> sawa. So, so, so that's it guys, that's the update. Uh, the business is doing well and we thank God. Let me show you how the business is now. Yeah. And please like this video in case you're still watching. Please give it a like. And this is an update on Mama Rachel and her daughters. So that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching this video to this part. I'm very very happy especially for this family because this is a definition of from grass to grace guys. This family was living in such a tiny house, such a house that I don't even know how to say and look at them right now. They can sell their own food. They can have food to eat without any problem and we thank God for that and all this would not be possible without you Malik squad. So thank you so much for the love and support. Kindly if you haven't subscribed to this channel please subscribe and make sure you're turning on the notification bell for more updates.